There are some people you just know by their first name. Pele, Tiger, and Lisa Lott. Look at it, just as Lisa Lott. And she burst on the scene in our national consciousness in 1988. She won the U.S. Women's Open, and nobody ever looked better doing it. <laughs> she won 13 times on the LPGA Tour. She won 25 times overall. Five times on the Solheim Cup, or was it six? Mm, yeah. Yeah, five yeah. or six in the <laughs> World Cup of Golf with Annika in 2006. Yeah. She was Rookie of the Year in, in uh, 1988. She won the British Open in 1994. When they didn't call it a major, I have news for everybody. If that's not a major, there's no such thing as a major when the oldest championship in the book is played. Hello, Lisa Lott. Hi. I'm so glad to see you. Yeah, nice to be here. We were talking just before we sat down and we looked at each other and said, I had no idea it would be like this here. I know. this. It's an amazing event. I, I feel like I'm at a professional golf tournament, you know, with just the way everything is set up for the players and, and the golf course. It's um, it's a major golf course, I think. I'm kind of glad I actually don't have to play this course because it looks awfully difficult. But... Um, but it's a beautiful place and you know with all the volunteers and just the whole setup it's fantastic there's something else i mean when you won the open little girls wanted to be like you they they wanted to win the open they wanted to look like you they wanted to play all over the world like you i mean you influenced a lot of people to play the game that have become stars so you really get the whole international deal and the other night when I was over at the, the Camp Olympia, and you were there too, it was the most amazing thing. You know, all these people sitting around picnic tables, essentially, just eating food out of a buffet, but there was this incredibly communal feeling and, and a reminder that golf is a universal language. Yeah. No, it's, uh, I mean, I think that's what golf is all about, right? For, you know, you get to travel and, and you get to, you know, do what you love most to play golf and you get to compete against all these different countries and but you know in the evenings we're we're kind of you know you're competitive on the golf course but in the evenings we're all sort of friends and it's kind of fun that you can hang out together and you you can have dinners together and you can play games together and you know you're watching all these kids who are playing basketball and and the ping pong and and you know pool and everything it's uh, it's just fun to see everybody just sort of socialize and it's it's all about you know, doing what you love most, but also, you know, you make a lot of friends, and but still be competitive. So it's, it's just a great, great event and, and a great game.